Sri Sri Ravi Shankar and the Art of Living Foundation are heralds of peace in a planet tormented by conflicts and violence. He teaches us that happiness and peace dwelled inside us and that we only need to connect with them in order to live our true essence. I met with Sri Sri Ravi Sankar in Bogota, our capital city, in June of last year, and I had a great joy of speaking with him about the efforts we are making in our country to end, hopefully very soon, an internal armed conflict that has lasted more than 50 years. Later on, with my consent, he met in Havana, in Cuba, with the negotiators of the FARC guerrillas and urged them to follow the Gandhian principle of nonviolence and to cultivate the art of meditation and breathing. We need to give them better understanding, bridge the gap and create an image that FARC is seriously talking to. Today, I want to thank him for this effort. In Colombia, we are promoting a culture of tolerance, of compassion, of harmony, because we want to have an increasingly fair and more equal society. In Havana, Cuba, the seat of the dialogue of peace between the government of Colombia and the FARC, we send a warm salute filled with affection to the Foundation International Foundation. El arte de vivir por sus 35 años de servicio a la humanidad. Permítanos en esta ocasión reconocer y agradecer a su fundador, Sri Sri Ravi Shankar, su preocupación humanitaria y su solidaridad para poner fin al más largo conflicto armado de nuestra América. Su encuentro en La Habana con la delegación de paz de la FAREP nos ha motivado a buscar por todos los medios el sendero que conduzca a Colombia hacia su encuentro con el principio gandiano de la no violencia. De la mano de Rie Rie hemos dispuesto nuestro espíritu, o mejor la ola y el mar, que son la mente y el cuerpo, en función de lograr la reconciliación y la convivencia de un país grande y bondadoso, cuyo destino no puede ser el de la guerra. Las enseñanzas del arte de vivir son fundamentales para el logro de una paz estable y duradera. Esperamos que la paz de Colombia sirva de inspiración para todo el mundo.